Okay, well so today I'm just going to talk about net neutrality. I remember when. I'm about to go real old lady on you guys. I remember when the internet, when there was no net neutrality. I remember having internet for free. I am being able to go anywhere I wanted to. I remember Comcast trying to buffer Netflix off of the internet and Netflix giving them the finger <laughs> by creating an algorithm that matched the bandwidth that Comcast was using for it so that I could stream at whatever bandwidth I had. Yes, thank you Netflix. I remember Comcast losing so many people and had to reorganize under a different name. Basically, I remember the free market working for the people. I also remember when net neutrality came into play. The cost of internet went up and the choices that we had disappeared. Basically, what the liberal left is saying will happen now that net neutrality is almost gone. I sincerely hope that net neutrality melts into the ground as a stain on the concrete of history as something that didn't work. There's no biblical anything really behind this for me. <clears throat> this is just someone with a memory who grew up with the infant internet and watched it be shackled to the government's stairs because it created a freedom for the people that the government could not control. I think as long as there's a free market in America, the internet will always be free because people will not stand for the things that like Comcast and AT&T try and do. People want freedom and they want the ability to make the choice of, you know, well, I don't want to pay you for this. So I'm going to go over here instead, or I'm going to make my own. So, like I said, there's nothing really biblical behind this other than the idea of freedom and the freedom to choose and the idea that if I have to, if I personally have to make the decision about what I'm going to believe about an afterlife or what I'm going to eat or any of those other things, then I have the ability to choose and to think for myself about the internet. We don't need to be protected. We just need the freedom to choose and take the responsibility for that choice. That's all. And that's all I wanted to say about that, guys. I know this is short, but I just wanted to let you know, I'm kind of just, I kind of gave up using a cell phone to record these because it really was not working out too well. So I'm going back to my webcam and hopefully I'll just get another webcam. If you can remember when the internet was post net or pre net neutrality, let me know down in the comments or at me on Twitter at Politicrist or on Facebook, same name. I'll have them either down here somewhere at the bottom or I'll definitely always have it in the description. All right, guys, until next time, be blessed. Remember to read your Bible this week and I'll see you then. Bye.